Hey, what's going on, dudes? My name is Tazza, and welcome back to another episode of my Ron Santo Road to the Show. And we'll be 13 this show, a bit of an interesting one today, guys. Washington Nationals, a very tough side to face, and uh, yeah, looking forward to it. I said the uploads would be coming a little bit more consistent as uh, time goes on. Uh, I have been really trying, uh, you guys should know. Uh, obviously, trying to build up towards the charity live stream, which make sure that you guys are there for, please. March 8th. Me and Dunbar Snapbar are going to be doing a charity live stream uh, to benefit the American Foundation for Suicide Prevention. So we are really looking forward to it and we really hope that you guys can come along and help us raise some money. Uh, you know, do some good, have some fun, some laughs. And, uh, yeah, I'm really looking forward to it. But here we have Jordan Zimmerman facing Edwin Jackson. Edwin Jackson really not doing too well. As in real life, pretty much. And Jordan Zimmerman, a solid picture all around. Statistics, maybe more for the game, not so much real life. But anyway, we get straight into this. And the Chicago Cubs have a one nothing lead. Ron Santo, we're going to step into the box now. He will get his first chance this game. Washington Nationals acquired some good players, obviously, within this game. I can't remember who the name of the person had behind the plate. Um, but never mind, anyway. So Ron Santo not going to swing on that one. The throw over. He's, he's not going to try it and run for third. Possibly good off there. There's the fumbled throw there. Joe Mauer, by the way, is the man behind the plate. Oh my god. I have had a tiring few days, guys. But here we go with a 1 0 count. Runner in scoring, two outs. Gets a big hit down the left field line there. That one is amazingly fair. I thought that was gone a bit far myself. But I don't care. Sliding head first into second, Santo with an RBI double to start this game off. 2 nothing Cubs. Good at bat, apparently. Very good at bat. Don't know how it stayed fair, but it did. And a big power hit there all the way down the left field line for Ron Santo. Zimmerman cannot believe it. And as we see in slow motion, just, just stays fair. And a great hit by Santo to start this game off. Sadly, there are no right-handers, so it doesn't look like someone is going to be stealing. Jackson here, up in the play at the moment. Not going to swing on that slider. Two-nothing lead. Not too much to worry about just yet. It is early on in the game. We're still in the first. We're still under pressure. But like I say, guys, um, please come along to the charity live stream. This one, though, well hit into the gap. Ron's going to try and go home. The throw is caught and Ron is not able to avoid the tag. Sadly there getting out. Good move by Mauer to try and apply the tag. Well. But yeah, sorry, like I say, um, charity live stream. I've had a busy few days but the uploads are getting more consistent as you should see guys. I'm really happy that it is. I'm able to do this. So, uh, don't expect um, an upload within the next uh, two days at least. Uh, because I have a hectic couple of days coming up and kind of not my fault-ish. Um, I have a staff night out, so my place of work is, uh, is saving up. We've saved up already, I should say. And, uh, we are going out to uh, to have a nice meal, to have a few drinks, have a good time. Uh, this is our kind of solid day off between all of us. and uh, I'm really looking forward to it. So tomorrow I'm going to be out in Manchester until the early hours I imagine and then Tuesday I have to work which is really unfair because I would like a relaxed day after that but apparently not so um, yes but that's what's coming up for me at the moment top four Santo will pop this one foul Mauer's going to be underneath that one with no problem not a great hit should not have swung on that at all poor at bat indeed not good from Santo there should have been a much more waiting for his pitch. I was hoping for a slider going to the farther side of the plate, but for some reason he decided to swing on that one anyway. But yeah, like I say, so I have to work uh, on the Tuesday. I've got a day off tomorrow. I've been working today, so everything's a little bit crazy, but I'm glad I can get the uh, the uploads a bit more consistent. Um, I know I said I was going to do this, and it, and everyone that stuck by me, I'm really really happy because like I know my uploads went really bad and then they're still not great. But I am trying to get back into it, guys. I hope you all understand that I did a bit of a roll call. I've got literally uh, two comments. Uh, 
which is really disappointing on one hand, but at the end of the day, at least someone is still watching, someone is still enjoying. And I'm glad you guys are still enjoying. Tyler Clifford is going to come in and start pitching for the Nationals, who have managed to claw one run back. Top seventh, no outs. 0-0 zero, zero count. This one goes deep down the right field line. Not well hit, but has it got enough? It has, and a home run for Ron Santo. When was the last time we saw that, guys? It has been a long, long time since Ron Santo has hit a home run. His fifth of the season, which is a lot, lot less than what we expected. Kind of built him up to be a bit of a power hitter. And sadly, he was not able to do it much this season. But that one, kind of crucial, potentially sealing a win, or at least putting the Nationals under a lot of pressure to come back. As Jackson celebrates with Santo there, knowing that this has put them three it runs clear this game. Santo happy in that one, like I say, not well hit at all. Deep down the right field line, 360 feet. Got just enough on it to clear it over the wall. It's a beautiful shot of the helicopter and the ball there, flying past each other. But anyway, here we have a potential massive moment. So Ron has already hit a home run, he's already had a double RBI. But here we have the bases loaded. Five Cubs lead, one out, zero, zero count here. Top of the eighth. So Santo potentially looking to put something on the board. A grand slam here would finish the game off. But a great hit straight down the centre. No grand slam this time. One run comes in. Another run will get there. The throw is cut off by Mauer coming off the plate. And a two RBI single for Santo. 7-1 Cubs lead. And a fantastic moment to get that. That pretty much must seal the game here. Very big clutch moment there for Ron Santo, forcing the fastball there. 99 miles an hour will go uh, <laughs> go as a ball. 1-0 count on Jackson, who potentially can also do some damage here. Right versus lefty, could see a home run, who knows. But big, deep hit, not enough though. The right fielder is well underneath that. This runner from second goes to third, giving Santo an opportunity to potentially look to steal here. So now we have two away. Chad Tracy will be the man to step into the box. Runners on the corners, two outs. Santo Willie look to steal. Good lead off the bag. Going to go ahead and steal. But ball is dropped. An easy way for Santo to get in. So a little fumble there amongst the catcher and the pitcher. Allows Ron to get over to second. Scoring position for both players now. Chad Tracy only really has to get a single We've got at least one run in here. 1 0 count on Tracy. Another 99 mile an hour fastball. That is something that is incredibly hard to swing against. But it doesn't matter anyway. Just one more step off the bag. With a 2 0 count on Tracy. Potentially looking to bunt, who knows? 2 0. Pitch is swung on and missed at 98 mile an hour this time. Slowing down a little bit, but that does make the count 2 and 1. More pressure here on Tracy. Just a decent hit would finish this game off for sure. As that one is just within the zone, that 90 mile an hour changeup evens the count at 2 and 2. It's not great at that so far. Looking to swing on something here perhaps. And wait a second, just off the bag. Swung on and missed in the dirt. And that will end the inning. The Cubs do have a fantastic six run lead. Thanks to our man Ron Santo. Ten hits so far for the Cubs. But Edwin Jackson still pitching through the game, and that is the entirety of the game. A good win here for the Cubs, eight to one. Jackson with his first win of the season, and Ron Santo with his first player of the game in a good while. An outstanding performance today from Santo. But thank you for watching this, guys. Make sure that you come and join me in Dunbar Snap Bar on March 8th. Player of the game for Ron Santo. And uh, please stay by me. I know you guys are a little bit stressed. Maybe oh well. I love you all, guys. See you in my next video.